in this corner of Northeast Pennsylvania, there's a world-class facility that addresses substance use disorders, the biggest public health problem in the United States. There's a change in brain chemistry, and these brains become hijacked, literally hijacked, by neurochemical changes that happen with prolonged substance use. This doesn't free a person from responsibility for their actions, but it helps us understand what has been incomprehensible to family and friends. And oftentimes it's incomprehensible to the patient. The patient doesn't understand sometimes, why am I doing what I'm doing? I want to stop, why can't I stop? And they can't stop because their neurophysiology has changed. I'm very proud of the level of care that we provide for detoxification of guys in the Marworth. First of all, our philosophy and approach to the patient. We don't want the detoxification process to be something we do to the patient. We engage the patient and partner them in the care. Detoxification here is really tailored individually. When we treat a patient, we're not just treating that patient. We're treating all the people who love that patient, who feel helpless and hopeless about their loved one. Outpatient care is, in many ways, it's the first level of care that patients who have substance use disorders get. It's less intrusive on their day-to-day -day life. Many times people are still able to work and function and can go to care, can go to treatment after work. Inpatient care is residential care, and that means that folks live and reside at the facility. And they're being treated from early in the morning to late at night. And they have different aspects of their care, both medical, psychological, psychiatric, and counseling care provided within that time frame. So it's a very intensive approach. At Geisinger Marworth, we treat their medical complications from their substance use. And those complications can be very, very serious. Infections that they've acquired from using uh, drugs intravenously, so endocarditis, cellulitis, lung abscesses, bone abscesses. We're one of the few places in Pennsylvania that do this. It's not just the restoration of health, it's the restoration of dignity. That's the most thrilling part of treating people with substance use disorder and the most rewarding part.